in a world where every mystery seems just a Google search away from being solved. There are still images that defy explanation, sparking wonder and sending shivers down our spines. These 20 photos stand as silent witnesses to the unexplainable, each one holding a story that no scientist has been able to decipher fully. These are not just photographs, they're gateways to the unknown, each daring us to look closer, think deeper, and imagine what lies beyond the edge of the explainable. So, let's embark on a journey through the mysterious, the uncanny, and the outright terrifying. Number 20. The Nazca Lines Have you ever wondered about those huge, mysterious drawings on the ground in Peru that you could only see properly from the sky? Well, you're not alone. These are the Nazca Lines, one of the biggest puzzles out there. Found in a desert 250 miles south of Lima, the ancient Nazca people carved these enormous figures into the earth. We're talking about a collection of incredible artwork, showing all sorts of things, animals, plants, and strange shapes, all etched into the ground over 2,000 years ago. What's cool is that these aren't just random doodles. They're so big that the full picture only comes together when you're way up in the air. And after more than 80 years of scratching their heads, scientists still can't figure out why the Nazca people made them. Despite all our modern tech and smarts, the reason behind these ground drawings is still up in the air. In 1994, the world gave these mysterious lines a big thumbs up by marking them as a UNESCO World Heritage Site. It shows that some things are meant to keep us guessing, right? Number 19. The Voynich Manuscript So, there's this ancient book that's been messing with people's heads for over a century, and it's sitting in Yale's library gathering dust and intrigue. We're talking about the Voynich Manuscript, a name that doesn't ring a bell, but hear me out, this is different from your average antique. Discovered by Wilfred Voynich, this medieval manuscript is a wild ride from start to finish. It's crammed with bizarre illustrations and text in a language or code that has yet to be cracked. Imagine flipping through pages of unknown plants, strange figures, and what looks like star maps, all in a script that might as well be alien. It's been a real head-scratcher since the get-go, once owned by an emperor and puzzled over by some brilliant minds throughout history. But still, no dice. The writing, with its weird gallows characters, is like nothing else on Earth. What's it all about? Ancient alien messages? A medieval prank? Who knows what truths lie within its pages? Number 18. The Dyatlov Pass Incident in 1959, a hiking trip in the Ural Mountains turned into one of the most baffling mysteries of the 20th century. Nine young explorers, led by a guy named Igor Dyatlov, set out on what was supposed to be an epic 16-day ski trip, but it ended in tragedy. They were found dead, their bodies scattered around their torn-up tent, with some eerie details that don't add up. Some were without shoes, others half-dressed, and a few even had signs of radioactivity. The weird part? Dyatlov was discovered with his fists clenched, lying in the snow as if fighting an invisible enemy. Fast forward a few weeks, and a search team stumbles upon this horror scene on a mountain, ominously named by the locals as Dead Mountain. The official line? An unknown natural force took them out. Yeah, right. With the Soviet government keeping a tight lid on the details, the rumor mill went into overdrive churning out theories from military experiments gone wrong to encounters with mythical creatures. Over 60 years later, the Dyatlov Pass incident remains a cold case of chilling proportions. What happened to those nine adventurers on that fateful winter night? Number 17. The Ubaid Lizardmen Over in Iraq, at a spot called Talal Ubaid, some archaeologists dug around and stumbled upon something wild from about 7,000 years back. They found these old artifacts that were something other than your run-of-the-mill ancient stuff. Nope, these pieces featured beings that looked like a mix between humans and lizards. We're talking about way back before the era of the Sumerians, around 4,000 to 5,500 BC, to the time of the Ubaidians. These folks were ahead of their game, crafting T-shaped houses and laying streets that morphed into bustling towns. But here's where it gets really interesting. Among these discoveries, especially in places like Ur and Iridu too, were these bizarre statues. Picture beings with elongated heads, almond-shaped eyes, and snouts like lizards, a hybrid creature vibe. Some were even depicted holding staff or caring for baby lizards. These so-called lizard men have left everyone scratching their heads. Were they worshipped? Did they represent some deep mythological lore? Possibly linked to the Sumerian deity Enki or some secret ancient society? Number 16. Hook Island Sea Monster 
Back in December 1964, something wild happened in Queensland, Australia. Robert Le Sirac, the guy at the center of this tale, claimed he spotted a gigantic sea monster. We're talking about a beast resembling a supersized tadpole stretching about 79 feet long, decked out with eerie stripes. The shot that stirred up all the chatter? It captured this colossal critter chilling at the sea's bottom, sporting what seemed to be eye spots and a peculiar mark near its tail. Le Sirac spilled the beans to a magazine, saying the monster appeared to be nursing an injury, possibly from a boat, and was taking it easy in a shallow spot. He even tried to sneak a closer peek, but chickened out when the thing started to stir. However, Bernard Huevelmans and Ivan T. Sanderson couldn't buy the story. Sanderson speculated it might have been a hoax involving a plastic bag or a deflated balloon tangled in seaweed. Digging deeper, Huevelmans uncovered Lacerec's sketchy past, filled with debts and dubious deeds, suggesting the story might have been a stunt to rake in some cash. So, was this monster for real or just a clever scheme? Number 15. The Piri Reis Map in 1513, an Ottoman admiral named Piri Reis crafted a map that still has folks talking today. This wasn't just any old map, it was etched onto gazelle skin and showed off the world with a level of detail that had everyone's jaw dropping. Fast forward to 1929, and Halil Etham, a museum director, uncovers this gem in Istanbul's Topkapi Palace during renovations. This map is special for a bunch of reasons. It's one of the first to show the Americas right after Columbus sailed the ocean blue, but here's where it gets wild. It also seems to show Antarctica, a place no one was supposed to have seen until 1820. And not just Antarctica, but one without ice, which hasn't been a thing for over 34 million years. The map's got other quirks too. It pictures Europe, Africa, and bits of the Americas with a mix of spot-on accuracy and creative guesswork. Some islands are made up, while others are missing entirely. Plus, it's a Portolan chart, filled with azimuth lines instead of the usual grid, making it a masterpiece of navigation. Scientists think this map is too good for its time, sparking theories ranging from advanced ancient civilizations to alien assistance. Despite the wild speculation, Piri Reis said it was all based on existing maps and knowledge of the day. Number 14. Fairy Cycle out in the vastness of the Namib Desert, you'll find something that'll make you do a double take. Perfect burnt orange circles scattered across the land, surrounded by lush grass. Looking down from above, these circles could easily pass for masterpieces crafted by divine beings, legendary creatures, or extraterrestrials. The locals, the Himba tribe, spin tales about their origins, while a German scientist once pegged sand termites as the architects, thinking they did it to hoard water. But cutting-edge research now suggests these fairy circles are all thanks to the plants themselves, pulling off a remarkable feat of organization to endure the harsh desert life. This groundbreaking insight made its way into a top-tier science magazine, flipping the script on our understanding of these phenomena. And get this, similar circles popped up over thousands of miles away in Western Australia, mirroring their Namibian counterparts. Over there, termites are out of the equation, backing the theory that this is all about self-organization. Plants are in a constant tug-of-war for water, leading to this stunning natural arrangement akin to mud cracks drying up. It's a testament to nature's resilience, showing us that life, even in the driest corners of the world, has a knack for creating order and beauty. Number 13. Soloway Firth Spaceman Back in 1964, Jim Templeton, a regular fireman from Carlisle, decided to take a picture of his daughter Elizabeth wearing her new dress during a family outing. Little did he know this photo would turn heads around the globe. What was meant to be a simple snapshot at Berg Marsh, with the scenic Soloway Firth in the backdrop, turned into an enduring mystery. Clear as day in the background stood what looked like a spaceman in full gear, stark against the rural setting. This wasn't just a family photo anymore, it became a sensation, stirring up a frenzy among UFO buffs convinced we had visitors. The twist? Jim swore they were the only ones there save for a couple far off in a car. The plot thickened as neither the police nor Kodak could spot tampering with the image. Kodak even threw down the gauntlet, offering a reward to anyone who could debunk the photo as fake. Yet, no one could claim it. The Solway Firth Spaceman photo keeps its secrets to this day, leaving us all wondering about the mysteries lurking just out of sight. Number 12. Traveling Hipster Tucked away in a digital collection named Their Past Lives Here, 
by the Brailorn Pioneer Museum lies a photograph that has sparked endless debates. Captured during the 1941 reopening of the South Fork Bridge, one figure in the crowd sticks out like a sore thumb. Clad in a casual t-shirt adorned with a peculiar design, sporting sunglasses that scream modern chic, and clutching a camera that seems out of place for the era, this man has fueled wild speculation. Could he be a fashion-forward local, or is there a chance he'll be a visitor in the future? This intriguing snapshot has gone viral, becoming a hot topic among enthusiasts of mysteries and the unexplained. Despite attempts to demystify the man's anachronistic appearance, the conversation is far from over. The possibility of a time traveler frozen in a moment from 1941 continues to fascinate and bewilder. Is it merely a case of historical fashion faux pas or evidence of time travel? Number 11. Antikythera Mechanism in 1900, a group of Greek sponge divers stumbled upon an extraordinary find off the coast of Antikythera. What they thought was just another relic was a groundbreaking discovery. They had uncovered the Antikythera Mechanism, a piece of technology that seemed misplaced in history. Housed now in the National Archaeological Museum in Athens, this device is no ordinary chunk of metal. It's a sophisticated assembly of bronze gears that could very well be the world's first computer, dating back to around 60 to 70 BCE. Some estimates even suggest 200 BCE. This ancient Greek invention could predict astronomical positions with astounding precision. It's mind-blowing to think that such advanced tech existed over two millennia ago, offering a handheld view of the universe. While modern researchers have unraveled much of its functionality, the Antikythera mechanism continues to be fascinating. Number 10. The Babushka Lady Mystery on that fateful day in Dallas, November 22, 1963, when chaos ensued following President John F. Kennedy's assassination, a peculiar figure captured the attention of many. Amid the widespread panic, the babushka lady, named for her distinctive headscarf reminiscent of Russian grandmothers, stood calm. With a camera glued to her face, unlike the surrounding crowd, her composure was striking as she seemingly documented the tragedy unfolding before her eyes. What she filmed or photographed remains an enduring enigma, as neither she nor the captured images have been identified or surfaced. This mysterious woman and her potential evidence have become a cornerstone of speculation and conspiracy theories, surrounding one of the most scrutinized moments in American history. Many wonder if her footage could unveil new insights into the assassination or lend credence to the idea of a broader conspiracy at play. Despite decades of investigation, the babushka lady's identity and what she may have witnessed through her lens continue to elude historians and investigators. Number 9. Bigfoot In 1967, Roger Patterson and Robert Gimlin ventured into California's Six Rivers National Forest with a mission and a camera. What they brought back has kept the world buzzing ever since. They captured footage of what looks to be Bigfoot himself striding through the forest with an air of mystery. This film has become legend, igniting a firestorm of debate and curiosity. Over 50 years later, the image of that large, hairy figure moving with such purpose continues to enchant and puzzle viewers. This piece of film has been scrutinized by believers and skeptics, leading to endless discussions about its authenticity. For many, it is compelling evidence of Bigfoot's existence. For others, it's a clever fabrication. Regardless of where you stand, the Patterson-Gimlin film has undeniably fueled the Bigfoot phenomenon, inspiring countless expeditions, spoofs, and scholarly analyses. It remains a pivotal moment in the lore of cryptids, keeping the legend of Bigfoot alive and thriving. Number 8. The Ghost of Freddie Jackson just two days after the unfortunate accident that took mechanic Freddie Jackson's life, his fellow squadron members posed for a group picture. But here's where it gets eerie. Freddie seemed to have made a posthumous appearance upon developing the photo. Looking closely at the back row, four faces from the left, Freddie's face appears amongst his comrades. This chilling photo was taken on Freddie's funeral, adding an extra layer of mystery to the story. Those who knew him were adamant. The face in the photo was undeniably Freddy's. The question that haunts everyone is how Freddy Jackson managed to be seen in a photograph taken at his funeral. Number 7. Black Knight Satellite 
The legend of the Black Knight satellite refuses to fade into the cosmos, fueled by stories of an alien observer lurking in Earth's orbit for over a century. This enigmatic tale took a dramatic turn, with claims of being intercepted by the Illuminati, adding a layer of conspiracy to an already intriguing story. The mystery deepened with the 1998 STS-88 mission images, revealing a strange black object adrift in space, reigniting talks of this ancient satellite as the International Space Station came to life. However, astronaut Jerry Ross clarified that the mysterious object was a lost thermal blanket. The plot thickens with Nikola Tesla, who, in 1899, detected unusual radio signals, prompting some to speculate a link to the Black Knight. The legend endures despite logical dismissals of alleged proofs of the satellite's existence, sparking discussions and theories about extraterrestrial surveillance. The Black Knight satellite remains a compelling mix of myth and potential reality. Number 6. Eusapia Palladino Levitation Table In the heart of Paris in 1898, a photograph capturing the extraordinary event of a table seemingly floating mid-air shook the world. The central figure, Eusapia Palladino, an Italian medium known for her claim to bridge the living with the spirit world, was at the center of this enigma. This eerie image, taken by a French physician during a seance, was meant to document Palladino's purported ability to levitate objects, among other supernatural feats like conjuring materialized hands and moving objects without touch. Skeptics and believers alike have scrutinized the photograph, taken under conditions claimed to be tightly controlled with Palladino's limbs secured by assistance to prevent any trickery. The photographer staunchly defended the authenticity of the levitation, asserting the absence of any physical manipulation by Palladino or alterations to the photograph itself. He also witnessed additional phenomena, such as a glowing hand and a face forming in putty, further mystifying the session. Yet, this iconic photo remains controversial, with detractors pointing out potential flaws. Palladino's awkward pose the missing shadows under the levitating table, and the theory of concealed supports or wires. Number 5. Sriyantra Geoglyph Hovering above the Oregon desert, a pilot spotted something extraordinary, a gigantic Sriyantra, an ancient Hindu symbol, etched into the earth with astounding accuracy. Discovered by Lieutenant Bill Miller on August 10, 1990, this geoglyph wasn't a mere sketch, but a masterful creation sprawling over a quarter mile, with lines meticulously drawn to 10 inches wide and 3 inches deep. This remarkable design, visible in a place regularly monitored by pilots from the Idaho Air National Guard, appeared seemingly out of nowhere, sparking intrigue and mystery. The plot thickens as, despite the frequent air traffic, there were no witnesses to its creation, no signs of the artist's presence, no tire tracks, no footprints. The geoglyph's precision, embodying the Sriantra's symbolic harmony and complexity, led to wild speculation. Could this be a message from beyond our planet? While a group later stepped forward claiming responsibility, armed with nothing but rudimentary tools, their story was met with skepticism. The precision they claimed to achieve was never replicated, leaving more questions than answers. Number 4. Oumuamua When Earth witnessed Oumuamua, it sent shockwaves through the scientific community. This wasn't just any space rock. Its unique, cigar-shaped body stood out dramatically from the comets and asteroids we're used to seeing. The buzz around this mysterious visitor wasn't just about its shape. As it danced away from the sun, Oumuamua did something that left scientists scratching their heads, inexplicably sped up. This isn't typical behavior for celestial objects unless they shed gas and dust like comets giving them a nudge, but Oumuamua, it kept its secrets, showing no signs of the usual comet activity. No gas, no dust, nothing. It was like watching a car speed up without pressing the gas pedal. This peculiarity fueled wild theories, including the possibility of glimpsing an alien technology, perhaps a probe from a civilization billions of miles away, checking us out. Oumuamua's silent yet stirring visit remains one of the cosmos's many mysteries, a reminder of how much is still unknown. Number 3. The Marie Man In 1998, the Marie Man etched a vast figure across the Australian outback, stretching an impressive 4.2 kilometers in height and leaving observers in awe. Dubbed Stewart's Giant, this depiction of what seems to be an indigenous hunter sparked widespread curiosity. 
entrepreneur Dick Smith even offered a $5,000 bounty for anyone who could unveil the story behind this colossal land art. Spotted from the skies by Track Smith, the figure carved a path 45 meters wide through 28 kilometers of desert. Fast forward to the present, and even NASA's Landsat 8 satellite has captured images of this striking creation. Mystery envelops its origins, with anonymous tips hinting at the involvement of an American cult and a peculiar plaque found near the artwork's nose. Reminiscent of Olympic memorials only thickens the plot. Despite rumors swirling around the late artist Bardius Goldberg, who allegedly confessed on his deathbed, the true mastermind behind the Marie Man remains a problem. Crafted before the era of GPS technology and without any trace of machinery, its redefinition in 2016 revitalized interest. Number 2. Tehran UFO Incident The evening of September 19, 1976, transformed Tehran from a city of skeptics to believers when an unusual light spectacle took over the sky. Reports of strange lights, initially dismissed as stars by the Iranian Air Force, took a sharp turn towards the uncanny, as the lights were no celestial bodies. An Air Force officer's sighting led to a high-speed jet pursuit into the night, some 70 miles from Tehran, in a fruitless chase against an elusive UFO. As the jet neared the object, its instrument began to malfunction regaining normalcy only upon retreat. Declassified reports from 2020 shed light on this night's events, revealing a bewildering encounter with a UFO, radiating with an array of brilliant lights, its size and nature remaining a puzzle. The encounter escalated when a second jet faced what appeared to be a missile launched by the UFO, which mysteriously disappeared without leaving any evidence behind. Years later, the secrecy surrounding this incident continues to fuel speculation and intrigue about the enigmatic visitor that graced Tehran's skies. What secrets did that night hold? Number 1. The Falcon Lake Incident on May 20th, 1967, Stefan Michelak's routine prospecting trip in Whiteshell Provincial Park near Falcon Lake, Manitoba, took a jaw-dropping turn. What started as a quest for quartz ended in one of Canadian history's most compelling UFO sightings. Michelak stumbled upon two cigar-shaped objects hovering above. As one touched down, curiosity led him closer, only to discover its surface resembled colorful heated glass. Despite attempting communication, he was met with silence. The encounter escalated quickly when Michelak, drawn to a vent-like structure, felt a blast of hot gas that left his clothes in tatters and his hand burnt. This incident stands out for its detailed account and the physical aftermath Michelak endured, making it a centerpiece in UFO lore. To this day, the Falcon Lake event puzzles skeptics and believers alike, making a moment where the unknown ventured uncomfortably close. Suppose you enjoyed this video. Like it and share it with your friends. We've also arranged some others you will surely enjoy on your screen. So enjoy them until we see you in the next video.